My favorite shoe wear, socks and slides. Best thing to wear ever. Dusty, you is dirty. That's why I call you Dusty. For everybody wondering why I call her Dusty, this is literally why. This is literally why she's called Dusty, bro. Look at this. Look at this. And y'all know I wash my car a lot. Look at this. That's why she's always called Dusty, because she lives in Florida. What is a video without a cold start? What's poppin' Play Boys? Welcome back to another video, man. And for all you new subscribers, what's up? My name is Sean. I drive a 2015 Honda Civic SI named Dusty, and she's never clean. Never. Even after I wash her. I don't understand this. I hate Florida. But today's video, man, we're gonna be talking about the hybrid short shifter that I installed in my recent video. If you guys haven't, if you guys haven't seen that, go check it out. I'm gonna leave the link like right in the corner of this video, or you can click the link in the bio, well, description. But yeah, man, here it is. It's all nice and crispy, boy. This light white shifter is gonna be gone because it looks awky to me. I don't know if you guys think, but I think it looks like, it looks too big. Like, this is small and this is huge. I don't like it, but yeah, I got a new shifter on the way for this bad boy, and it's gonna match the hybrid racing, and it's from hybrid. So I'm pretty sure you know what that's gonna be. But yeah, man, today we're gonna be talking about how I feel about the hybrid shifter. Is it worth it? I can't say if it's better than a cutie because I only drove a car that had a cutie for literally like over 20 minutes. So I can't really give you a, a full review if it's better than a cutie. But I can tell you now it looks better, it's cheaper, and it's hybrid racing, bro. They make parts for Hondas for years now. Cutie, they make parts, but uh, they're kind of expensive, bro. And plus, if you use my code Zooey, you can get some money off and get this shifter for a steal, like a really, really good price. And it's worth it, bro. And it's real crispy. I can't make. This is just fire, bro. It's just fire. I keep noticing, I keep saying hybrid shifter. It's hybrid racing short shifter. Hybrid racing short shifter. Hybrid racing short shifter. If you guys want to go purchase it, I'm going to have the link down below. Use code Zuvi to save some money. And uh, yeah, man, go bang some gears when you get it. All right, guys. So hopefully you guys can hear me loud and clear. Probably the, you know, talk like I'm yelling at y'all, but y'all understand why. Because GoPro audio like sucks butt. But. All right, so my reviews on the Hyper Racing Short Shifter is that I love it, bro. It's really good. I've been driving this. I've been driving with it since uh, the install video, which was like a week ago. And got no complaints with it. Feels wonderful. Sits feels perfect. Sometimes I feel like I'm not in gear because of how short it is. Like, literally, bro, it's, it's crazy. The install process was pretty simple and easy, too. Only problem I really had was installing the shifter cables. That, I guess, I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty sure that's a pain in the butt on every shifter to install. Because, like, those shifter cables do not want to go in and they do not want to come out easily. But, yeah, bro, 
beautiful, bro. I don't want to go back to anything, bro. Like, I feel too crispy. And then the knife gen, like gearbox and all that stuff, bro. I swear, knife gen had the best gearing, bro. Like, the gearing, the way you shift, like everything. Like, the transmission just feels so good, bro. I don't know if y'all can, like, relate. I don't know what y'all do with y'all knife gens. But for me, my knife gen. Dusty? My transmission ain't dusty though. This thing is buttery. I love this car. So if you guys are thinking about getting yourself a hybrid racing shifter, I say go for it. Especially because of the price point. Plus they have two different color options. I know Cutie only has one and it's black and purple. And I'm sorry, I'm not a fan of purple. Purple and black is alright. But red and black, black on black, especially in this car, you can't go wrong with that. Also, I don't know if you guys like to do what I like to do, but I like to show off my shifter like how I'm doing right now. And having the red, like stand out on the car with the red seats and the black interior, it just makes the car look twice as better. Who you be breaking legs? Give me on that, boy. This nigga gay. Wait, no homo. But, uh, yeah, it just keeps the, keeps the interior looking lively. It just looks beautiful. I feel like if I had a cutie shifter, I'd put a gold on it because, like, it's black and purple. I don't have anything purple in my car. Not saying cutie shifter is bad. I'm not trying to bash them, but hybrid racing, bro. We waited for so dang long for this, and it finally came. And it's not like it came out trash. This is a banger, bro. This is freaking amazing. Like, and its shifts are so crispy, bro. And the price point of this shifter is cheap. If you're looking to buy a knife gen short shifter and you're not trying to spend over like shoot i don't know 450 freaking bucks by a cutie you should definitely go for hybrid especially if you use my code zuby i'm gonna keep saying this because i'm trying to help y'all but use my code zuby bro and i'll save you some money but yeah bro this shifter is buttery now look, look, at, these, look, look at these shifts look at these shifts look at these downshifts satisfying feet like feeling when you get in there and it actually clicks or something like that like like that just hearing that it's just uh, and the shift is like it makes it i don't know how to explain it bro it just makes it satisfying to drive your car and also i know you guys get in gear and you shake your shifter it's wobbly this has no play at all like none I'm shaking the shifter. This is literally all I get. I'm in gear right now. I'm in four gear. This is all I'm getting. With stock, bro, it's, it's like it's in neutral. So that's a huge upgrade, especially when you're trying to bang gears and you got to shift fast. It's easy to actually catch a gear. You don't have to be guessing where your gears are at. And also, it has a lot of adjustability. They have two different uh, adjustabilities. They have a uh, one and a two. The one's for longer throws. And the two's for shorter throws, of course, but it's still shorter than stock if you didn't put it on one. Right now, I have it both set on two, so this is the shortest it could get, and this is literally, that's, I gotta keep showing you guys that, because this is ridiculous, bro. This is neutral. This is the third. This is third. This is neutral. This is third. Listen to Dusty eat, bro. She hungry. Give me a pop, Dusty. Give me a pop. Thank you, Dusty. Shifter, 
bro, I ain't missing nothing. All right, guys, so this is where I'm going to end off the video, man. If you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like, comment, subscribe. Follow your boy on Instagram, my underscore got to soda. And if you guys are interested in going buying a, you know, nice little short shifter for your birthday, your Christmas present, hit up your girlfriend, send the link to her, tell her to get you something nice, man. You don't want no shoes. You don't want no socks. You want a short shifter for your car. But yeah, man, if you guys are going to go get yourself a short shifter, the link's going to be down in the description. I keep saying bio. And uh, use code Zuby to save some money. And your boy's out. Peace.